Hi, I know a lot of people who use Mac OS X have problems with Dashboard, so I'm going to do a tutorial on that today. So, um, if you want to activate Dashboard, you, um, you go to the Dashboard icon, which is a black circle with, um, some, some dials on it. Uh, it's located right next to Finder in the default, um, in the default dock. So if you want to go ahead and click that, it'll bring up your Dashboard. Um, I have some of the default widgets, and I also have some of the some of which widget, some widgets that you can um you can get um that aren't on your computer initially um some of the main ones such as this this um this weather one if you click it it'll uh go to the city that you programmed in and show you the weather um uh let me get back to it um the calculator you can type in numbers and um it basically is just a calculator uh this is a clock um, this is, um, iCal, it, uh, syncs your iCal, um, events, so it shows you when there are upcoming iCal events, and it shows you a calendar, um, and, uh, this is just a unit converter, uh, if you want to get more widgets, you can click the plus icon in the bottom left hand corner of your screen, and, um, there, some of them include, um, address book, um, Flight Tracker, if you're in an airport, um, ESPN, where you can get sports scores, Dictionary, you can look up words, um, Yellow Pages for business, you can search Google, you can do iTunes, you can play your songs and Dashboard, um, there's Poker, Sticky, Stickies is very interesting, you can um, write notes like uh, buy milk in uh, different colors and different fonts, so you can change the color here and you can change the font if you want just search like that um, then there's stocks, there's games you know there, there's everything, anything you want um, and some people want more than this so if you want you can go on the Apple website and uh, under, under downloads there is a whole download section dedicated to widgets uh, they have lots of widgets you can search, browse by category, so that is very, very helpful. Um, also, um, you can rearrange your, your widgets like this. You can put them wherever you want. And um, yeah, that's about it for dashboard. Um, there's one more thing if you want. If you go to, uh, let's say, a video site, and uh, you want to uh, upload a video and put it on your dashboard um, on a YouTube thing you can click this uh, this scissor button right here open a part of this page in dashboard um, so you can select what you want I'm going to select this video and click add and then you'll uh, you'll have the YouTube video in your dashboard like so um, also if you want to remove a widget that's on your screen you just click the plus icon in the bottom left hand corner and each existing widget will have an X on it. You just click the X to get rid of it. And uh, that's about it on Dashboard. I hope you found this helpful.